Assalamu alaikum everyone, what's going on? Welcome back to Quarantine Cooking with Halal Fest. See, I got my Halal Fest shirt on. My name is Abbas Muhammad, and today we're gonna be making something so sweet, so delicious, you're gonna fall in love over and over and over again. What is that? Kulfi. In fact, this is so easy, I'm just gonna step it up a little bit of a notch and make two kinds of kulfi today. Mango kulfi and kulfi malai. Well, let's get to it. To the crushed white bread, which we also call double roti back in Pakistan, I'm gonna add some uh, evaporated milk, sweet condensed milk. I'm also gonna add one pint of heavy whipping cream to that mixture. Mix it all together, and this is the base for kulfi. We're gonna put half of it into a pot to make kulfi malai, and the other half will set aside to make mango kulfi. Step two. For kulfi malai, I took out three cups of the mixture that we made in step one. I'm bringing it to a low boil, and I'm adding in half teaspoon of cardamom powder, and three pinches of saffron. As you're bringing the milk to a boil, be sure to continue stirring it because you don't want the milk at the bottom to burn. Once it's at a boil, set it aside to cool. Now when you're chopping your nuts, you can keep your nuts around the same size that you prefer them. I prefer mine to be a little bit on the smaller side. The last thing you wanna do when you're giving someone a dessert is have them choke on your nuts. Step three. Now that the mixture has cooled down a little bit, I'm gonna line my pan with the crushed nuts, pour the kulfi mixture on top, and then top it off with a few more nuts, and then pop it into the freezer for about five to eight hours. Step four, now we've got our first batch of kulfi in the freezer, we're gonna make the mango kulfi. Super easy. You know that mixture that we set aside earlier on? All we're gonna do is add one cup of mango pulp. This is called KSR Mango Pulp. It is sweetened, and you can get it from any Indian store in your area, in your neighborhood, KSR Mango Pulp. So mix in one cup of mango pulp, and once the mango pulp is fully mixed in, line a tray with your nuts, pour the kulfi mixture with the mango pulp, and then cover it with a few more of your nuts. Then, this is gonna go into the freezer as well, in about five to eight hours. Step five, and my final favorite step. You know me, I love the last step, because that's when we get to try it. So let's head over to the freezer. I'm so excited to dig in. So we've got our mango kulfi, we've got our regular kulfi. Let's cut up some slices and see how it is. So I've got a slice of the regular kulfi and the mango kulfi. Which one should I try first? I think I'll try the regular kulfi. Mm. I'm so glad that we added the cardamom. It really adds a wonderful layer to it. And if you look closely, see the saffron in there? Isn't she lovely? Isn't she wonderful? I'm gonna have another bite. Mm. Okay, now let's spice things up with the mango kulfi. Mm. Wow, okay, no exaggeration. This just blows the other one out of the water. It's so much sweeter, it's so delicious. Ah, oh, and mango is a fruit, so it's healthier. Now, just because it's the season of Eid, we're feeling a little generous here at Halal Fest. Little bonus video for you, mango faluda. Now, I'm sure you've already seen my previous faluda video. This is very similar, except we're adding some elements of mango. The main difference instead of ice cream that we added in the faluda, we're going to be adding in mango kulfi. Thank you. 
Now hopefully you can take everything that I've taught you during this quarantine, make a wonderful delicious thing. Listen, you boys better put this on your bio data, okay? Let's prove to the world that Muslim men can be good at cooking. My name's Abbas Muhammad. It has been such an honor to have Halal Fest sponsor me to do these videos. And I've had so much fun on camera with you guys and cooking with you guys. And I hope that you make what I've made. Post a picture, tag us at Halal Fest. I'd love to see what you come up with. Eid Mubarak.